You might have seen him on television. He's not a star. He's not a host. He's not a judge on anything. He's not a no. stupid celebrity chef. He's none of the above, but very popular. And it's just exploded lately. Yes, because this all happened because Married at First Sight, there was an episode where Jessica and Mick got married. But yeah. But the guest at the wedding, who was Jessica's brother... Not seen for very long on screen at all. No. Became a viral sensation oh. immediately. Lonely chicks started frothing in their seats at home when they put this bloke's picture on the television. Very good looking very guy. Very good Lots looking. of tattoos. Yep. His um, Instagram went from 1,000 yeah. followers to 38,000 followers <laughs> in two days. <laughs> His sister, who's actually on the show. And beautiful. Only has half that amount of followers. So oh, it good just goes to show how popular this guy became after getting just, you know, five minutes of screen time. I would have to equate it to remember when the hot felon came out and everyone was it's getting just excited. Like that. It's and just the girls like that. just melted. Yep. Well Reese, he's not a felon. Not that we know of yet, but we got him on the phone to just say, Bro, look at you skyrocket. <laughs> hey Reese. Good morning. Hey guys, how are you? Pretty good. Very good. <laughs> I noticed that even sports bets have now have now placed odds on the next TV show you'll appear on. So have the they? number one pick is Love Island as a contestant. D- uh, let's uh, first establish: Are you single? Even I am recently single the oh, last yeah. couple of months. <laughs> how long were you in a relationship for? Uh, it was a pretty short relationship. Yeah. Just a few months, yeah. yeah okay. Right. And so you're single, you're on the market. What did you think when your Twitter, your Instagram just exploded overnight? I was sitting there watching it with a friend and my phone just started blowing up. Went from about 1,100 to um, about 40,000 now. <laughs> oh, my God. That's <laughs> Were you like, bro, I've gone viral. I'm going to be hitting and quitting for the rest of my life. <laughs> yeah. I actually didn't know how to take it. I've had messages from modelling agencies, TV shows. Wow. What TV well, shows still, have you had messages from? That's amazing. Uh, just, I'm not allowed to say anything, actually. Oh, oh my God. So you are getting headhunted for yeah, TV shows. Yeah, he's getting casted. I Good thought work. the Why sports not? bed thing might have been a bit of a joke. No, I but think you should uh, be. You're actually getting yeah, tracked down by these producers who think that... Well, I'll show you the ones. The ones that are on sports bed. So Love Island's the favourite, which yeah. I think makes sense. Then it's Australia's Next Top Model. Um, the Bachelorette <laughs> as a contestant. No, you want to be the main person. They also have The Bachelor as well. Um, and then it gets a bit silly with Australia's Highway Patrol. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll probably <laughs> appear on that one before he does. Yeah. <laughs> um, have, have I mentioned any that have messaged you? You have. Oh, wow. Wow. Reese, does your sister, is wow. she like, this is my time to shine? Like, what is this? Well, actually, wasn't very happy about it. She called me up as... Kind of abusing <laughs> <laughs> And there's also been like rumours of like whether you're a stripper or what you do for a living because there is on your Instagram pictures of you hanging out. Is it the Magic Mike stripping guys or something? I don't know. Well, oh, I'm a I'm a qualified carpenter, so that's my day job. And yeah, on the weekends I I do a bit of stripping. I have for the last four or five years. Are you the sort of good stripper that gets your full dick out, or are you just an underpants oh, only I- stripper? I am. I get it all out. Oh, and you're doing <laughs> the dancing and the the thrusting and all that. You've got to it, yes. Oh. I don't like you're not getting it all out. No wonder he's single, this bloke, because he wants to keep his options open. I get You're only a young man. How old are you? Uh, 27. 27. You know what I really liked about you? That you that you were more worried about making sure someone that was marrying your sister was a decent guy was a totally mm. down-to-earth, decent bloke that treats her well. I really liked that about you and your dad. I thought it was awesome. Yeah, I think that's what, what every big brother kind of wants, especially... Yeah. Meeting someone for the first time, don't, don't haven't really met him. Yeah, just kind of wanted to make sure that he was a nice, upstanding guy. Well, yeah. see, me, my sister hasn't had a boyfriend since she was sixteen, and now she's in her fifties. And I just beg any bloke to throw a leg <laughs> over that. You're the opposite. Yeah, <laughs> just to make my sister happy. Like she's uh, she's been lonely a whole life. I'd, she says she's not lonely. That's she's good happy. then. Yeah, well, you've got to believe liar. her if she says Listen, that. Send her, send her my number. We'll see what we can Oh, do. bro, let me trust me. <laughs> <laughs> you won't go there. <laughs> what What are you? Are you checking? Or are you getting a lot of DMs from girls that are just like yeah, you getting putting nudes? it out there? Are you getting nudes? Oh, of course, he's getting. I nudes. checked it this morning. I've got seven thousand two hundred and forty that I haven't read. <laughs> Direct messages, and wow. what are they mostly of girls sending you pictures? What are they? Just. Yeah, they're mainly old girls. A couple from guys that aren't too happy. Oh, uh, guys aren't too happy. Why aren't they too happy? 
Oh, I think a girlfriend's messaging me. Oh, oh, no. oh so they're, bl- they're blaming you. How are you getting blamed for that? <laughs> oh, I don't, listen, I don't know. I haven't, I haven't, I've tried to stay off social media a bit. But yeah. It, but you can't help it though, man. Like, if you're getting nudes sent to you, just unsolicited. Yeah. That's every man's dream to be in your position. I know. And un- unfortunately, there's a pretty, I guess with fame comes a lot of haters and that kind of stuff. So there's some, some false rumours that are going around about me, which is pretty like sad. Like what? what? What are they saying? What sort of things? Do you, do you want to clear any up? Uh, someone's got a photo saying that I've got arrows against me and violence against women. Someone took a photo off Google and posted that, that oh, I've done it. And it's pretty sad because I've had the girl that it actually happened to in 2015 message me crying her eyes out because she's just got over it now. This photo is going viral about her. Oh, isn't that just, that's terrible, isn't it? Oh, the, uh, this, and, and that's totally not true, is that what you're saying? It's just uh, like fabrication? It's, it's not true at all. Listen, I've never been in a fight with a guy or a guy Yeah, anyone. right, right. No, no charges so, or anything. Uh, anything else? Uh, any gay rumours? No, nah, no gay rumours yet, but it's only early, so we'll... <laughs> no. <laughs> Brooklyn, do you want to start... I'll, I'll hang start on, we got, a, we got a gay here in the newsroom. Do you want to start a rumour, Brooklyn? Oh, yeah, well, me and Reese have had a little, little <laughs> thing in the past. <laughs> yeah, right. I told you not to tell anyone about it. <laughs> Just, you jerking off in the corner while he's performing for ladies <laughs> is not a little thing. Just let me tell you, that's not a thing. That's only a thing for you, Brooklyn. Oh, Reese, look, uh, we'd love to have you in here one day or uh, pimp you out or something like that. Oh, yeah, you could do a segment. We do a segment called Naked Day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'd definitely be up for that, guys. He's primed oh, for that. I'm locking you in then. All right, girls. First naked dating returns with Reese. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's do it. Let's uh, organise it. If, now, and I'll make sure it's only wall to wall glamours. So like, no t- no secret toads, nothing like that. It'd be all. all <laughs> Listen, all women are beautiful, so. Oh Take yeah, sorry. I, hang on, I thought it was 1980 again. Hang on, let me read the current. <laughs> let me read the current rules. All women's bodies are beautiful. <laughs> I can't they say are. that with a straight face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shit. Um, okay, well, all right. Well, we'll do naked dating, and if you want to do naked dating with Reese, you can register on thirteen one zero six five girls. Opening uh, the lines. Maybe you can hit him out on your DMs. Let him know so we don't have to chase him all around. Yeah, I was going to say, you've got like 7,000. Yeah, put a poster up. Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) We'll we'll do the graphics for you, so it looks awesome. Mate, look, good luck. Good luck to your sister. Hope it all goes well. Yes. Uh, Especially you. Is your dad also single? Uh, He's seeing someone at the moment. All right. Well, let him know if that goes south. He can do naked dating too. (laughs) Yeah, we'll open it up to the whole family. (laughs) Thanks, buddy. Nice to talk to you. Reese Power, what a name. The name Reese Power. Oh, yes. oh you know, and I bet, I, oh, I bet you once you finish with a lady, you go, "You've been powered," <laughs> and you throw the rag down. Do you do that? I don't, but I might start doing oh, it. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, you should yell out "Presto" when it comes out. You've been powered. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I should change my last name to Power. <laughs> it's a great last name, isn't it? I just want to use that little catchphrase at the end. It's awesome. Yeah, you can't do much with Sanderlands. No. You've been Sanderlands. <laughs> <laughs> Not the same thing. Let's go. Kiss. Kiss. Kiss.